Welcome back to the Plus Side of Nashville. You know, hope can be a powerful message. It's a message the organization Hope Kids wants to convey to the chronically ill children and families they serve. Joining us now are Hope Kids participants, Mallory Porter and her precious handsome son, Jackson. Welcome! Hey, bud. Hello. Say hi. Say hi, Jackson. Hi. Can you see yourself over there? <laughs> He He's is amazed. Oh, so handsome. Well, well thank, thank you. you all so much for being yeah, it's here. it's our pleasure. It's our pleasure. Tell us a little bit about Jackson. Yeah. How old is so he? So Jackson is four. He'll be five in July. He obviously has a lot of energy. <laughs> <laughs> very spirited. So yes. yeah, um, we've had a pretty challenging year just yeah. with all that he's had going on medically. So he's been really enjoying just the fun he gets to have with Hope Kids. Isn't that right, buddy? Yeah. Do you want to so tell everyone about Jackson? it? Jackson? Can you look at me? Can, Can you, you look, look over, over here? here? Tell me what do you I'm like about Hope for me? It's what's been fun for you. I don't know. You don't know. What's been your favorite thing that we did? We got to do a lot. Hey! Predators. Predators. Well, of course, we love the predators, don't we? Yes. And now you've got a news hound to go with your collection of other stuffed animals, don't you? Say yes, ma'am. Hey. hey, what other fun activity did you I get to do with Hope Kids? Do you no. remember? No. Did you get to do <laughs> Jurassic World? Yeah. Can you tell them about it? Can you tell them? Can over you look here? over here and tell them? Dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. Do you like dinosaurs, Jackson? Yes. You do? What do you like about them? What do you like about dinosaurs? What do you like about dinosaurs? We have a dinosaur party. You like them though? They had some big dinosaurs, didn't they? Yep. There. Yeah. Well, fantastic. And we've gotten to go to a couple of different shows. Yeah. Jack, can you tell her about Aladdin? Did we get to do that with Hope yes. Kids? Yes. <laughs> and trick or treating. Right. Trick or treating. Right. But why do we, why do we always do that one? <laughs> because we're trying to see you on TV, and Is we want amazing? you to talk to me. Yeah. Okay. Can you talk over here? Just ignore that camera over there, okay? And talk to me. Can you do that? What? Well, do you want to go with Miss yeah, Deb? Yeah, do you want to go over there to Miss Deb? Oh, or Miss Melissa? Or Miss Melissa. Go on over. Go show Thank them you, your Jackson. new puppy, buddy. Go show them your new puppy. Go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> there you go. Oh, thank you so much oh, for being here. He yeah, is adorable. Well, thank you. Tell us a little bit about how you became sure. a, a part of the Hope Kids. Yeah, program. of course. So Jackson was born with a condition called neurofibromatosis. It's a genetic neurological disorder where tumors form on the nervous system. And so we've been a part of the Vanderbilt world since he was born. Yes. Um, he also was born due to the condition with his um, tibia was bowed. And so he's had a few reconstructive surgeries there. And he um, also had has a brain tumor due to the disorder oh, yeah. as well and so um, Vanderbilt has been fabulous they really you know love the oh, children yes. and take care of them yes, and <laughs> I was thrilled when they told me that they were turning over some of their fun social activities for the children for Hope Kids to so do. That's how yeah, you found so that's about how I found out. Kids. Mm -hmm. So did you have anything similar to um, Hope Kids? No before? there wasn't a specific program um, Vanderbilt did do a few different, like they would open up Predators games or they would open up, you know, maybe some family photo shoots just due to outside organizations donating to the hospital. Yeah. But then when Hope Kids, came, Hope Kids came on the scene, they really just let them it's take over. Amazing. Yeah, and it's been, it's been great in a lot of different ways. I mean, obviously, he's high energy. And so <laughs> despite all that he has going on physically, yeah. he um, really enjoys a lot of the social activities and being with other children. And I think what is extra meaningful for him is he always gets excited whenever he sees other children who are either you know in a wheelchair he uses a walker um, because of his oh. sur leg surgeries or if he sees other children with a leg brace or here's of other children that have a port you know yes. for chemotherapy yes. like he has um, it just kind of makes him feel he always gets excited and points it out <laughs> it makes him feel like he's around something familiar and something comfortable. Yes. So, so you know. I see how it has been, Hope Kids has been a huge impact yes. on you and your family. Mm -hmm. is, sure. is, is Jackson the only child? He is. Yes, he well, is our only. He's your mm -hmm. only child. And so I feel like that this is probably an organization that you would definitely recommend to oh, anyone else who may be going through anything similar. Absolutely. Okay. Hands down. They just, they offer so many different options. There's, you know, for all the different interests yeah. that children might have. And 
so my husband and I have really just enjoyed seeing how much, you know, Jackson yes, benefits from absolutely. it. Absolutely. Well, it's been so, wonderful to have you on well, the show. Thank you. And Jackson is adorable. <laughs> and I wish you both He's nothing but else. the best of love. Well, thank you. I appreciate you and your that. beautiful family. Thanks. Thank you for being here, Mary. Absolutely. It's our pleasure. And when we come back, more cuteness. <laughs> we'll meet another beautiful family helped by the services of Hope Kids. So stay with us.